Hello everyone, and welcome to Just Brent. In today's video, we have a very special guest. He is a professional ballet dancer for Serbia National Ballet, and also a YouTuber. His name is Yuki from Yuki's Room. Yuki's Room was so nice to join us today and collaborate with me on this video as I interviewed him on his journey from Japan to Serbia on becoming a professional ballet dancer. Before the video starts, I just want to let you guys know one thing. The translations in the video will be colored yellow when I'm speaking and white when Yuki's room is speaking. Alright, let's get to it. You ready, Kyoshi? Let's go. Yes. Thank you so much, Yuki from Yuki's room and Slovakia National Ballet, joining us today. How are you doing today? Yuki <laughs> Thank you so much. We're just going to ask you, of course, like, you know, a couple questions just about you, about Japan, and just some cool stuff, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. First question for you is where are you from in Japan? I'm from Kanagawa. Yeah, it's really close to Tokyo. It, it's next city. So it takes like one and a half by train. So it must be like the summer must be so hot, right? Yeah, kind of. There's beach, so like. Quite oh, many people come also to same as well. So when did you start to dance ballet or just dance in general? I started by like from five years old. Actually, like I also did like basketball and also football oh. around 10 years old. Like I, I also didn't like the ballet, like there's not many boys. So. Yeah, right. Just in Japan in general is like boys they're okay doing ballet? Like people are like, oh, he does ballet. Are they a little bit like, you know? Yeah, sometimes they make the fun. Make the fun. Like weird, right? Like, oh, you, you doing like this? Is it not for the girls or something? Like yeah, same as here. But now you can tell them like, hey, I moved to another country and I'm doing exactly what I like. So <laughs> was there a reason you started dancing when you were so young? My sister, my sister does it as well. So. It's quite common reason, I think. No. When did you know, like, I want to be professional ballet dancer? Actually, like, I don't know when and how. Like, I just want to be better and then, like, want to keep dancing and then mm. be a professional ballet dancer. Yeah, <laughs> you did it. How did you get to Slovakia National Ballet, like, from Japan? Yeah, I was learning in Vienna and then, like, I came as a private audition here. Mm. And then, like, to get the contract, so it's that's why I came. <laughs> now, how many years have you been with Slovakia National Theatre? I'm already here like eight for eight years. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Yeah, know. now it's like 80 people. Mm -hmm. You know, everybody brings stuff to the studio, you know, lunch and then shoes, clothes, but is there anything that you bring to the studio every single day that you can't leave your house without? I have like bowl, like two together, like this. Uh, you know? Like yeah. I really like it, and then like <laughs> sometimes I had problem with my box, so like mm. I always have it for the studio. A lot studio. of people take like uh, here they take a sock, long sock, uh -huh. and they put two tennis balls inside. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of like the same, you know. Yes, yes. If you have any moment in your life on stage performing, is there anything that you remember was like the most funniest thing? that you saw or did on stage? I had one time, like my courage step on my heel <laughs> during the dancing, like during the dance. Mm. He stepped on my shoes, so like uh. it, like, oh, it come off. Your shoe fell off. Yeah, <laughs> like I have to dance after like 10 seconds or something mm. after this happened. So like, just I'm trying to <laughs> beat and then like, I, just left, like, I just left on the stage. <laughs> Yeah, but well, it was like good experience as well. Like <laughs> now it's getting better. People are going back to the studio. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All this crazy stuff going on for having so many months off. What have you been doing to try to stay like in ballet shape? I, it's a secret. I did <laughs> sometimes like if I feel good, like oh I can do some trades, but but I did like once a week or something. So like I recognize, oh my god, like I have to do more. How is the first day in the studio? Oh, <laughs> it, it was Piatti's class. Okay. So, but like, <laughs> my abs is like, like <laughs> I can only become like, <laughs> so like, I tried to do some bar, but like, it's easy, easy way. way. <laughs> very, very easy way. <laughs> it's weird to touch the bar after. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you were not a professional ballet dancer, what are some things that you think like you would do in life? Mm, but actually, I really like to go on stage or go to the front of people. So like, I want to be also other some stage person. Like, mm. I don't know, actor or... Mm. Maybe on a big TV screen, you can be like famous movie star or something. Yeah, that's cool as well. <laughs> yeah. This is like interesting question I like to ask is mm -hmm. if you start your life over, uh -huh. like from, from, beginning, from, from beginning, beginning, would you choose to dance when you were five or would you choose ne never to dance? Oh, that's hard. <laughs> hard. <laughs> Maybe ballet. Yeah, the ballet? actually like I really love it. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. <laughs> the next questions I'm gonna ask you is like I will ask you something and you're gonna tell me what your favorite thing of each category is. First one is what is your favorite ballet performance? For sure, Don Q. Your favorite role that you ever dance? Basil. Yeah. <laughs> For me it's like like okay actually I can like I retire can really now. <laughs> <laughs> Who is your favorite dancer to watch? Stephen McRae. Stephen McRae. Yeah, he, he's not really tall, like he's kind of short, but like he was like amazing. Beautiful. Mm. What is your favorite Japanese food? I think ramen. What is your least favorite food? I can eat, but like I'm not really like the taste of broccoli. Do you have a favorite Japanese anime? My favorite one is Slum Dunk. Actually, like the comic one is the better, mm. but like also anime is good. And what is your favorite thing about Japan? Mm, maybe like some, like how can I say, 24 hours stuff. And also karaoke. What is your favorite thing about Slovakia? Nature stuff. The mountain or like river is really beautiful. Mm. Like. What is your favorite thing to do when you have a day off? Playing game <laughs> or like going to out with some my friend and drink. The next section is I will give you two options. Mm -hmm. And you will just choose one. Classical ballet or contemporary ballet? Classical ballet. Do you like to wear on stage jazz shoes or more ballet shoes? Ballet shoes. Do you like to perform or watch Nutcracker or The Sleeping Beauty? To watch is Sleeping Beauty. I think to dance is Nutcracker for me. Would you rather do jumps or turn? Jumps. If you go to bar or center, Adagio or Grand Allegro? Grand Allegro, for Allegro. sure. Do you prefer the summer or the winter? Summer. Mm. Do you prefer to drink tea or coffee? Tea. Milk tea or more green tea? Green tea. Do you like the flavor chocolate or vanilla? Chocolate. Chocolate. Do you prefer the holiday Christmas or New Year's? I think in Jap when I was in Japan, I really liked New Year's. Mm. But like now Christmas holidays for me is more bigger. Yeah, kind of. yeah fun for me. Are you a more morning person or in nighttime? Nighttime, man, I cannot really wake up early. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for Thank helping. You. Yeah, do you want to say anything else to the millions of people watching? <laughs> <laughs> mm, yeah, come to my channel as well and then subscribe to also my channel, please. Yeah, we're gonna put a link to Yuki's room in the description and the comments below. So make sure you click, click, and then click that subscribe button for him because we thank him so much for joining us today. Thank you very much. But thank you and best of luck and please don't get injured. Oh, thank you. Thank, thank you. you very much. All right. We will see you soon, sir. See you soon. Okay. Have a good day. You too. Thank bye you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you so much.